Hello, everybody. Welcome to the return of the Great Goaty Hunt from Min Max. Uh, ooh, it's actually popping up. That's very handy. Uh, I'm Ben Hansen. That is... Jeff Marquefava. We're here to chew bubblegum and kick butt and play Doom, right, Jeff Marquefava? Right. No, we're going into Doom Eternal. We're going to be starting a new game in Doom Eternal um, because we let Patreon supporters vote every week on what we're streaming. And this week, they had the choice between... What was it? It was Bleeding Edge from Ninja Theory, mm -hmm. um, Animal Crossing New Horizons, and Doom Eternal. And we're doing a deep dive, like, game club on um, Animal Crossing, so I thought that would win. But people said, Doom. Doom right mm -hmm. now. And so we're giving us, giving Doom you it. Doom right now. Yes. Okay. Here's the ultimate question, uh, That's everybody. right. Um, I'm feeling uh, hurt me plenty, but Jeffem, this is your this is your, your game here, baby. Uh, what do people want? Just do, do hurt care? me plenty. All right. That way we'll have some real tension here, right? How much have you played of this? Uh, I played quite a bit. Okay. Maybe um, maybe like a third of the way through. Okay, sure. What do you think so far? I'm enjoying it. Oh, good. It. It's Against a bit... all the evil I'll turn oh it down God. Hell can conjure. God is talking to us? All the wickedness that mankind can produce, we will send unto them only you. Rip and tear until it is done. Hi, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Tyler Davis, Seth Puddle, Yarrow, Knocking Nick. Thanks for sticking with us. Thank you for sticking with us. Hello, Shift on Twitch. People are wondering how much story there is compared to... There's Doom a lot of story, two. and it's a little confusing. Really? Yeah. Like the plot, or just uh, why there's so much story? No, the plot... The, there's kind of multiple societies that you're learning about as you go on, and it, it seems like they've both been living on Earth, and it it just doesn't make... There are these massive structures that apparently just no one on Earth knew about for millennia. As huh. Like the Great Wall of China? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What kind of fiction is that? Miguel Lopez says, Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Buenos tardes. A key. No. All right. Look at that. Attempting to acquire the Show up. People are wondering how the soundtrack compares to 2016's. Of our has been it's very doomy. Well, I'm, sure you'll, I'm sure you'll like it if you this is good, liked good. it and the original soundtracks. Ready? There you go. So yeah, apparently Doom Guy is is an alien. Is that true? Or he looked like it, a human. I know, but that's what's confusing about it. Is because the some of the aliens look very human. Or they're an ancient race. You're just really? gonna shoot a lot of people? Huh. There you go. There we go, baby. This is the mood you gotta be in. There we go. Uh, Shift says he was human, then he was converted. Let okay. us know if the volume's okay. I know we gotta rip and tear and play it loud, but let us know if the levels uh, are I'm right. I'm actually gonna be doing a pacifist run. Oh! Okay, okay. so. <laughs> oh, I failed it! No, you fool! We gotta fool. restart. You fool! This environment seems so odd. Is this how, like, the original Doom 2 opens? Or is this an homage to something that I'm not familiar with? It's doomy, you know. This is it? Is... Okay. Yeah, they're going to teach us some stuff. This we tutorials isn't there. very Doom. Hey, get out of there, pal. Ah, uh, he, uh... Boy. See, why can't Resident Evil have aiming like this? <gasps> yeah, why is one shot they explode into a million pieces yeah. of Resident Evil? Joy Hello says he wasn't really into 2016's Doom, but this looks cool. Do you think he should check it out? Um... I guess it depends on what he didn't like about 2016 Doom. Because it's guns and blood. It is very much the same. 
they've kind of built on all the different systems and there's more upgrading along the way but if you don't like constantly being in big arena battles with a million demons right. and constantly on the edge of dying the entire time then Might not it's be for probably you. still not for you right right double jump we got a double jump hot damn was that the first i can't remember okay are you a um fake ass gamer boy we didn't ask you yeah okay how cool. much of this have you played hansen um i'll show you where i stopped yeah <laughs> it's coming up in about 34 seconds there we go based on your save file i'd say it was right here it was literally right here not, I have not spent a lot of time with this. Ooh. Good God. Doors. I don't need them. Doom guy doesn't have time for hinges. Oh my God. Great animation. Yeah. You unlock double jump in Doom 2016 on the fourth or fifth level. Thanks, uh, Jordan. And Michael. Michael Larry, hello. Good to see from you. Good to see from you. Jesus. Yeah, so like in the first game, what well, I think it was like in the, uh, you, ooh, I'm gonna on ammo. So you need chainsaw to get more ammo? Chainsaw to get more ammo, glory kills to get more health. Wow. Like grandma always said. And then, yeah, and then you will eventually, uh, you'll get a flamethrower that when you light people on fire, they will drop armor. And so you kind of have to cycle between doing those three special moves in order to keep your supplies up. Gotcha. Just like Resident Evil 3. <laughs> yeah. Hey, pal. Just take it easy. Oh, oh. He, he's trying his pacifist run. That's there really odd. It's just like there hoping you're moving so fast that you never run into those weird encounters. That's the first time I've actually seen anything like that. Weird. Yeah, we're playing on a, a pretty high-end PC here, just for frame of reference. But you're playing on Xbox? Yeah. How's it look there? That looks great. It looks like this. Okay. Have you played more Ori by chance? Uh, no. I got stuck in this little area, and it over it auto saved over all of the like backup save files, and one of the you know, the game director or something reached out and was trying to troubleshoot it, but then he basically said that there's no fix for it. So, reach out just to you? Yeah, on Twitter. Oh my god. Huh. Uh, but so my save file is just. Oh, that bored. sucks. So. Oh no. Now you kiss it. Kissy, kissy. He is really just staring at that. Uh, hello, rock party. Hello. There it is. Wow. No time to even look. Nope. Now we can, though. Come on. That's right. Has been terminated. The demonic consumption of Earth has been reduced by 36.8%. There are two hell priests. Surprise, we've been on Earth the whole time. Oh, my God. Yeah, so those, I think they're... They're kind of big temples that those guys carry around with them. What are, what are? That place that we were just in. It's like oh, a shrine. Interesting. Uh, full auto. Nick C says, shout out to this game having the best HDR implementation in maybe any game yet. That's there interesting. You go. Very specific. I love it. I love it, Nick C. Yeah, knocking Nick has the correct response of just saying, whoa, <laughs> seeing that. Like, that, mm -hmm. those are really cool. What? Nothing's better than seeing a big thing walk around in a world that yeah. you can interact with. So you'll be getting weapon mods again like the first game. Mm -hmm. uh, which will kind of fundamentally change how each weapon works. And then sure. you'll be upgrading them as well. Oh, these little buddies. So you killed the first... Dark Lord Templar Priest of yeah. Doom. That didn't seem that hard. No, you. That that guy's a gimme. 
Okay, the you'll other have, two are like big boss challenges and stuff? the other two. Okay. Is that the overall objective for the game? Uh, so far of what I've played. Huh. But I feel like we're going to run out of hell priests. Right. Woo -wee. No fall damage. My dog hates me. Says only thing I don't like about this game is the limited amount of ammo you can carry. Seems like a cheap way to amp up the difficulty. Yeah, and you so you can. Uh, that's another. There are different upgrades, and you can upgrade how much ammo you carry. But it's still it remains pretty stingy. Gotcha. Bob Buell says, "Wait, does Doom Guy have like an Otacon who radios in and talks to him?" Yeah, I. I don't know if that's like your ship AI, um, hmm. but he he doesn't say too much. Okay. He just gives you a little info on your objectives. Oh, chance out here, buddy. Yeah, I realized that uh, I have an upgrade that makes you jump farther a farther distance in order to do those kills. Gotcha. Which. I, I think Imran was talking about it uh, when he was talking on the last podcast a little bit yeah. um, about how it is a game that gets easier as you play just because you'll be getting all of these different unlocks and upgrades and abilities. You have like a double dash that you can do in the air and stuff. Hmm. Um, so going back to this is actually a little more difficult. Yeah. Get out of here, pal. Is this on Nightmare? No, we're doing Hurt Me Plenty. I yeah, believe. which is just the normal. Sutton says this game is hard. Yeah, I was playing on the next higher difficulty for a while, but yeah. it, it's a weird it's a weird balance of the of kind of the power of fantasy that you have when playing this game, where right. you become a real glass cannon and it, just a hit or two can kill you, which I I can appreciate the fact that the harder the harder difficulty that you played on, the more it makes you really think about the tactics that you're doing as you're running around. Yeah. Um, but definitely find the balance that feels right for you. There we go. Sweet weapon wheel. I just got a weapon wheel in Animal Crossing, so I guess these yeah. are pretty similar. Heavy cannon. Yeah. Actually, I did, but it's for tools and helpful things. Right. You can't punch a hologram, you maniac. Whatever. <laughs> Daniel Wittendale says, what's an average runtime for this game? Let's see. That's oh. a good question. I will say the levels are very long. Really? Like, I'm surprised by how long each one has been. 13 and a half hours, according to how long to beat there. Cody asked if you tried out battle mode yet. No, and it it doesn't seem super appealing to me. But it, I think it seems fun. That's like the 2v1 thing. Yeah. Can we try it at the end of the stream? Sure. Yeah, I was a little disappointed to see that, you know, they don't have the snap map or any kind of deathmatch modes. Right. Even though people weren't in love with certain yeah. affinities mm -hmm. deathmatch last time, but... But I would have, I would have just liked people still being able to build their own arenas, you know, yeah, and yeah. do challenges like that, instead of just a kind of two v one mode. Let's see, what's supposed to be doing there? I wonder if like before they make the next Doom game, if they just release it as a standalone multiplayer thing, and actually have it design it and stuff. Yeah, people might be pissed about that, but. Poor souls. So, uh, hell's on earth, huh? Yep. You know how it goes. Did you, um, so you played, like, the original Doom way back in the day. You were in love with all this stuff. Were you ever scared of Doom when you played it? Uh, no. It's similar to the Resident Evil thing where every now and then something would jump out. Yeah. Or, and, like, the original Doom, they, they could be real jerks about... You know, like spawn closets and things. You'd, you'd pick up a, you'd pick up a power up, and then they would plunge you into darkness with a bunch of enemies that you couldn't see. And they had some moments like that. Yeah. Lord. 
but in terms of like you know i don't know how religious you grew, you grew up and stuff but you're never like ooh, it's the scary game no. or anything like that. you're a pretty cool guy though yeah yeah hide by the red barrel guy hmm. Lazarus Orange says pinkies used to surprise me in the original game. Yeah. My dog hates me. Ben, did you watch the new Final Fantasy VII remake behind the scenes? No, I haven't. I've been meaning to watch that. How how is it? I, that first one showed so much that I'm a little bit wary of watching it, but I'll probably check it out here once I get time after we record the Deepest Dive uh, Animal Crossing Game Club. Right. We won't worry too much about secrets. Oh, this gets a lot less spoilery. Oh, that's good. That's the bad That enemy design is hilarious. Get that health, Jeff. Um, get that health. What was oh, that? Oh. A little launch pad? Launch pad and a quack. Hmm. Oh, no! You need it for the health. You need to do that to that poor creature? Yep. I didn't need to do that. So, the weird, like, fusion with technology thing for that creature? Yeah, that's, that's also a, a little confusing. Well, I just don't get it. Like, do they emerge from hell and then it's like, ooh, technology? Or do they have, like, computers and metal in hell? Well, they obviously have the music metal in hell, but do yeah. they have, like, tech? Yeah, maybe... Uh, was Squid the one telling us about the lore, Doom Where's, Guy lore earlier? Oh, I don't know. Uh, maybe you might be maybe someone it. from chat can tell us a little bit. Uh, part of it is that the UAC Corporation that's always been in Doom has been doing experiments and trying to revive uh. the creatures that they found, but it also seems like the older society was much more advanced, too. Okay. Hmm. So, it's kind of a weird mix. And the way that they design their... All of their... Ooh, we got a key card. Oh my god. The way that they've designed all of their different facilities and stuff is just absurd. It's all like... Yeah, we need a... We need like a 50 foot tall skull that shoots out flames right in the middle of that. <laughs> it's very fun. Hey, yep. jerk. We're trying to torture your friend. Leave us alone. Oh, no. Are you still fighting where you're at in the game, like, the same enemies, or is it all different? Uh, they... Those are kind of the fodder enemies right. that are always there, but they add a lot more different enemy types as you go along. Shift one two three says Doom Guy is a sentinel. That is the advanced one. Yeah, Does that makes sense. An advanced kind of race that were maybe on Earth. Hmm. That's that's where I get a little confused about who started where. Yeah. Get out of here, buddy. This guy. Yeah. Oh. I'm rooting for this guy. Ooh, I almost died there. Jesus. Jeff, this game is fast. I don't know if you noticed this. Yeah. There have been a couple days where I've played... Oh, he's, he wasn't dead. Yeah. <laughs> Funny. There have been a couple days where I've played like three or four hours in a row, and that's just way too much. You know, yeah. My brain was actually felt like it was melting, which is always <laughs> the marketing. But not in a good way. No. Uh, somebody's asking why we're not playing with the mouse and keyboard. Because uh, this is the way Jeff was playing an Xbox One, so he's used to it. So back up. Yeah, I'm. I'm sure that would help tackling the. Well, let's do the micro missiles. That's fun, right? Yeah. Magic missiles, absolutely. Sci-Fi guy says it gets even faster with upgrades and the dashes later on. Yes, That's I'm. Insane. I'm definitely missing the double dash. There are your grenades. Noah DeKal says, I beat this last night. An absolute blast. Yeah. I've Sweet. been enjoying it a lot. 
Okay, we get it. Yeah, that's, they need a more like metal presentation at least of those. Yeah. It feels very clinical. And where is it? Kako Demon! Kako! Oh boy, don't do that. Okay, we'll just. We'll head on. All right. uh, really? Is that this is what you're supposed to do then? Yeah. We just got a time. Oof. Pretty yeah. tight timing. Yeah, my butt clenches every time I have to do any kind of jump like that. Oh, no! No! I know. I, I feel a little bad for those guys. Yeah, they're Because they're funky. cute. They are cute. It's they're like cute a little monster wrestler right. guy. Knocking Nick is wondering how much the original you played, or 2016's. Uh, maybe like three quarters. You didn't it, beat that no, either? No, it was one that I didn't beat. By that you mean the standard video game for you? Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. It's, I believe it's still on my PS4. It, it's one that whenever I'm trying to decide what to delete, it's like, no, I, I enjoyed that too much. I'm going to go back to it. Oh, wow. But now I'm super not going to go back to it. Yeah. Uh, my dog hates me. He's wondering if we could just kind of get an update on how clenched your butt is at all times during uh, this yeah, playthrough. Yeah, yeah, sure. This Basically, percentage. anytime I'm in the air, you can assume that my sphincter is at maximum tension. And we appreciate that here in the Midnight Studio. But the kind of parkour aspect of it is pretty satisfying. Those, These bars get kind of... You can see... There. Yeah, what was he's, that? He's getting him to actually catch on to those is a little, a little iffy sometimes. Yeah. But, but otherwise, and once you once you get the double dash and stuff, it feels very good to be running around these areas. Uh, Mark Cruz says, "When's the cutoff for reading messages for the Animal Crossing Deepest Dive, which is our community game club that you can leave a comment on patreoncom Um Probably about right now. I need to. Once we finish the stream here, I need to um, jump over there and actually finalize that. So uh, go fast, oh, and we might be able to squeeze you in. Here we go. Why didn't you rip at that guy's eye? Yeah, he he didn't flash. I missed it. Oh. I missed the I missed the chance. Glug 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 glug." Jeff from treats games like pizza and never finishes the crust. <laughs> I always finish the crust when I eat actual pizza, though. That's yeah. the contradiction. You know. Uh, by the way, if you support us on Patreon during a live stream, patreoncom slash Boomx two ends. We'll uh, lose we'll, our minds. Yes, we'll we'll give you the shout out, cream dream thrill of a lifetime. As <laughs> Do you have to says. call it a cream dream? It's doom. We gotta be metal. Yeah, but it's more metal than a cream dream. No matter what. We could be playing Animal Crossing right now and you would still... An Animal Crossing cream dream. Oh, another one of those guys. I can't even take a sip of my tea. You want me to pour the tea just like over your face? Yeah. You can kind of slap it in a little bit. Still no shotgun shells. All right. This guy will splew just some ammo. The weapon wheel is, is one thing that I don't super like about it because once you get a ton of different uh, weapons, you have to kind of slow down time like that whenever you pick a new one. and it's, That helps, right? Yeah, it helps, but it also just kind of breaks up the pacing in a way that's... What's the other option? It's all right. I'd rather have yeah, it than I, not. There is no other option when you're playing with the controller with limited input. So right, but. right. What Noah wants to know what's your least favorite demon to fight so far. Some of them are pretty frustrating, especially the one who has the shield and axe. Shield and axe. Maybe you haven't found it yet. Yeah, I may not I may not be to that guy yet. Um That is a great question. They're all kind of annoying in their own ways. <laughs> but this is a fun game. Yes, it okay. is it is fun, but sometimes it's just a little puzzle. Yeah. Puzzle like where I am right now. Ooh, good map. Good map. Look it at is that. an exceptional map. And wow. You'll, you'll unlock upgrades that will, you know, kind of populate all the different secrets that you're trying to find. And yeah. then areas that are red like that let you know that there's going to be another arena battle in those locations and stuff. So, right. Great map. Super Nintendo says, how wild is it that Bleeding Edge is out today and it seems like no one cares? Well, it's it's a big week for games. Um Eesh. Plus, everybody will be playing it on Game Pass. I guess they want a multiplayer game because I don't think 
Doom Eternals on Game Pass. No, I don't think so. So, you know, I think there's a big amount of people that'll be playing it there. Plus, it's on Steam, so maybe people will check it out. I don't know. Kind of waiting on reviews for that myself, but oh my god. I played the beta and was not in love with it, but I'm willing to give it a shot. Wait, I was not supposed to jump there. Why am I doing it? That animation is so good of him. Okay, uh -huh. well, that looks a little janky, but that's still really satisfying. Uh, people are wanting to know how often you read the codex in this. Uh, I've read them all because they are kind of interesting. Oh, cool. That's, that's where they get into all that lore stuff, which yeah. is still a little confusing to me, but I also wonder how much of, how much more sense it would make if I had played through the entirety of... Oh, sure. Of the last game. Seems important. Uh, Shift123 says Bleeding Edge is currently mixed on Steam. Yeah, but for a multiplayer shooter that came out two hours ago, like, we'll see where it eventually lands. Maybe some more depth will pop up, but it's an interesting game for sure. I'm going to write down to mention that on the podcast this week, the Midnight Show. Oh, Scorch says he's really enjoying Bleeding Edge. Oh, good. That's good. Oh, those ground buttholes. I can't think of a better place for one. Yep. Thing is, sometimes they don't have those little tentacles that shoot out of them. So, huh. they keep you on your toes. That's what ground buttholes are for. They're real lenient when when a grenade actually goes in that guy's mouth. Oh, yeah. really? You know what? If you're close enough. I've noticed they're really lenient, too, with, like, the glory kills. Is that what they're called? Stuff? Yeah. It's like, it'll really, like, teleport you close to them for it. Yeah, and w there's an upgrade that you can get that will really teleport you across the room. Really? You know, per uh, perform those, which is nice. I like, too, like, when you're doing those sweet... Um, Little tarantula baby, mm -hmm. um, but I like how it, like uh, it blurs up the background, and, like goes like a narrow depth of field when you're doing the glory kills too. It's like a super quick, subtle thing. Yeah, it's really effective. Uh, Darth Turner, is it not possible to sub to you guys on Twitch? Uh, no, we're debating that, but uh, no. Sorry, we like YouTube, but we might we might shift that in the future. Oh my god. These guys. Low health! Yeah. Yeah, and like we said, it will only get much more frantic uh, when you've unlocked a bunch of power ups and stuff. Gotcha. Tyler says, were those guys just fighting each other before they realized Jeff was there? <laughs> yeah, they everybody fights each other, but they don't actually do any damage to one another. Oh, so you weird. Can't, you can't just sit there and wait for them to kill each other. Huh. Because that's not that's not doomy. Right. People love the Mick Gordon soundtracks. Yeah. Get out of here, little brain buddy. Oh. There we go. There we go. I'm going to take you out just like the way I took out all of your brothers. You know... Nope. I should, I should not nope. be using all of my shotgun ammo. <laughs> Gate open! Yeah, sometimes they do that. It's, where the hell is that supposed to be? Yeah. Well, thankfully the map. Man. Good week for sound design between Animal Crossing, Doom, and Half-Life. Like, yeah. Killing it. Someone says the soundtracks are really good while you're playing, but then the idea of like humming anything after the fact. Yeah. 
You just end up it's... going like. Dang, 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 dang. Then Tom was like, says, will there be discussion of Doom Eternal soundtrack on Min Tracks? That's interesting. Um, no plans, but uh, we have a post for questions for Min Tracks going live later today, actually, at patreon.com slash min two ends. Um, oh. And so you can leave a question there and then we'll answer it there. But I don't think Matt Helgeson's playing it, but maybe he's listened to it a little bit. Because there's a new episode of Min Tracks, which is our music podcast, going live on Friday. Oh, apparently there's a game called Lost Words Beyond the Page coming exclusively to Google Stadia this week. Uh, ha. I gotta look into that. That's a weird one. But yeah, tough to get attention this week for sure. Maker is nearby. She is inside that demonic citadel. I will mark her location on your HUD. Thank you. Would you guess uh, from this level so far that this is on Earth? Yes. Okay. Well, I know that Hell on Earth is the whole thing for Doom yeah. 2, right? Is, but this isn't like a Doom 2 remake. Of hell I don't... Just it's just homage. Yeah, probably. Do you like Doom 2? Man. See, there's, there's the guy carrying one of oh, these, which fun. I think we're basically on the same. Hmm. Although this just looks like a... Hey, here's a, here's a really dumb question. Is there Satan in Doom? Ask the chat. Hey, hey, lore Hot experts. Chat. Is there yep. Satan in Doom? Uh, Bob Buell's asking who the guest is on Mintrax this week. This week, we're going to be joined by Bianca Reichert, Dan Reichert's wife, because uh, she loves death metal. So she is going to be pitching that Helgeson the death metal album. So look forward to that. You can subscribe on uh, your favorite podcast app, M-I-N-N-T-R-A-X. Thank you. It's Mecha Satan, they say. Doom guy is Satan. Yeah, that's it's that's kind of the weird thing about this m mix of lore, where apparently, so are the demons just kind of an alien race that's from a a really weird, freaky demon world? Is that the, what's going on? I don't know. I don't know. Huh. But then they use all the same iconography that we do when it comes to evil stuff, you know? It's, yeah, pentagrams and stuff. Lazarus Orange said the icon of sin was the big bad at the end of Doom 2, but not Satan Satan. That's weird. Kelsey no says, I watched the new Doom movie and it seemed like there was a Satanish guy when the main lady transported there. You watched the new Doom movie, Kelsey? I've never heard anybody talk about that. She says, I don't recommend watching it. The great con maker will be made, and the energy will be restored once again. As it is written, from the souls of the non-believers. You will not save them from their judgment. Yeah. <laughs> Guns. Oh, I guess that Doom movie's on Netflix. Everybody watched it. There you go. You cannot interfere. This is humanity's chance. To give service to us. See, she's just like some kind of robot alien, Can right? I don't know. The will of the con maker. Activating the portal now. For it was you who was meant to enforce it. Hey, that's beautiful. Yeah. We didn't do great. I think we did a fine job. Do you want to check out the multiplayer? Sure. Boosh! Hmm, battle pass. Oh, look at that. You're level two already. Thank you. I'll take all that. Yeah, the customization thing is weird. You can customize the Doom Slayer? Yeah. Hmm. Scorch. Oh, Lucifer isn't a demon, though. He's just in charge of the demon. Satan is a fallen angel. The pissed off God was sent to hell for eternity. Ooh, good Bible lore. Or he's being tortured by demons himself. It's confusing. Okay. I was... Gonna do the tutorial for this, and then it was 
surprisingly complex. And I was like, I don't want to go. We don't need no stinky tutorial. Demon loadouts and yeah. whatnot. Let's just get in there. Oh, but they're making us do it. Really? Oh, we can do it. Okay. Right, select loadouts. Okay, select. What is this? Bleeding edge? Loadout. Go to the abilities tab. To check your abilities. Now return to the lobby. We're going to really screw up someone's. Uh, it's for the good of the people. Yeah. <laughs> that was too much for you? Those because I was scares. actually reading. Oh, I see, you're I supposed see. to read what all your abilities and stuff are. That was it. Oh, was here we go. This is still just a tutorial. Okay. Jockeying. Jockey for position. Players cannot attack, but they can travel anywhere in the map. Once hmm. the countdown ends, all players can attack. Walk to the floating arrow. And Tom was like, says, this seems like Dota. Yeah, I smell Dota That's here. what they're going for. Mm -hmm. I like the jump thing. It's cool they have to animate all these different characters in first yeah. person. Where is the floating arrow? It's not a launcher? Uh, it must be deactivated right now. Oh, I guess our mic's on. <laughs> Don't mind me. Well, this is still just a tutorial. So. Yeah. Somebody said that uh, they played this in, with friends and they had a good time. That's good. Some traversal options only work for people. You can't use monkey bars. Come on. This is floating green arrow in doom. Well, I never. There we go. Summon support demons. Right button. Those. Sure. Oh hmm. boy. Does it tell me where I'm supposed to summon them? Apparently no. not. Okay. Well then, let's do a Arachnatron. Is that my oh, boy, no. a little brain baby? I, got, I guess oh. maybe this one. Okay. Wait, what do they want? <laughs> oh, perform some. Uh-huh. Perform Replace one to drop loot. I mean, at least they went for it. Yeah. <laughs> at least they're trying to do something unique, right? Yeah. Right now, though, would we rather just be shooting other players is the question. Well, yeah, but we can... We can learn. Ha! What do you think of that? Shield. Was I supposed to be doing something else? Will this be better received than Fleeting Edge? Okay. Player outlines, sure. God, I wonder how many people are playing this right now. That's a great question. Block loot? You can prevent the Slayer from replenishing his resources. X to remove loot drops. All right. Slayer loot block. Sucker! <laughs> block loot. Lazarus says, presumably they avoid regular deathmatch and not compete with the Quake champions. That's interesting theory. Maybe. Maybe. Mid-match upgrades. Oh, boy. Keeps going. Kill the Slayer with your summon. Select an upgrade. I should have read that better. Okay. All right. I figure like a little bit of a DM here. Get him! There we go. Just do Round that in the real one. game. Round one. There we go. Okay. Thieving hand. Oh, man, Bye. this is weird. Fire sounds good. Yep. A lot of fire. Yeah, so... Match, Man, you really? You can pick it even if you lose. 
Somebody's asking, where's the music? Yeah, we, we're wondering the same thing. Round lost. Okay. Remember how much fun we were having like 10 minutes ago? Yeah, but now we're seeing something new, man. Yeah. Okay. Four rounds. Can select another power upgrade. They, I mean, they certainly did go for it with, you know. It's the most damning compliment you can give. Oh, they're they're well, going you for know, it. I mean, it's also the people who are going to actually spend time in this are going to be the ones who are willing to actually learn these kind of things, and they probably would appreciate the depth, right? Yeah. In a way that we may not. Round four. Man, alive. Final round. Yes. Kill the guy. Please. Cody says he hopes that they bring Snap Map back. Yeah. I I really do miss that. The time slitter the time splitter is fan in me, you know, yeah. I always like that kind of build your own. I never saw any crazy stuff. Like I guess I'd only see that from like Twitter, but yeah. I never saw somebody be like, check out this crazy snap map thing they made, you know? Yeah, it seemed underutilized, which maybe that's why. Yeah. Alright. Now let's go. Now let's go. Tear him apart. Uh, Do we want to be the slayer or the demon? I want to be a demon. Well, I guess a quick play. Whichever, whichever. Yeah, okay. Let's roll the dice here. When you're doing live streams, you got to add some tension. Mm -hmm. Some gambling aspect, you know. It's important. Also, remember, we'll give you a shout out. Jeff promises it'll be the cream dream throughout the lifetime. You yeah. can support patreon.com. Emphasis on the cream. Absolutely. You get early access to the Min Max Show podcast, and you can leave comments and questions for us to read on any of our podcasts or on the deepest dive for Animal Crossing. And we're going to be doing the Final Fantasy VII remake coming up in early April. What are we? Oh, we're the Slayer? Yep. yep. Wow. All right. I'm just going to. This is going to go terribly. <laughs> <laughs> The menu music is straight out of Doom 2, apparently, people say. Let's I go. have looked at my... Oh, I guess we didn't look at the tutorial for the Slayer, no, did we? all my different weapon stuff. Whatever. Yeah, shoot the things. They're, shoot the things, guys. Yeah, they guys. got the tougher You got there. it. I mean, look how... Oh, that must be the axe guy that, that they were saying super annoying. Oh, great. Well, now we'll learn, won't we? Oh, we're going to get wrecked, dude. Can't wait. Uh, Grizzled Gaming is joining us on Twitch. Hello, Grizzled Gaming. Thank you for being a part of the Min Max community. Oh, who's your favorite community member, Jeff? You can't make me choose. That's the Sophie's I know, choice. But if of... you had to choose one. No, I will not. Everybody okay. is great. They all add to the community. Uh huh. And I love them all. Okay. All right. We're going to start that Twitter poll pretty soon of letting the community choose their favorite community member. Okay. That looks bad. Ish. You know, every bad guy is good in their own mind. Yeah. Ah! Jesus, you want music? No. Here's your music. Uh-oh. Okay. It's not slowing down anymore, is it? Nope. Oh, sure, poison. Eat okay. that, Gary. Uh, I don't think that was his name. <laughs> oh, it's more offensive than that, isn't well, it? Hey, maybe they're gay. And love hippos. I think actually a gay hippo moved into my Animal Crossing town the other day. All right. Do you have this gun in the main game? Yeah. Do you okay. shoot it better in the main game? Yeah, definitely. Don't. Oh. Yeah, somebody mentioned the music cut out again. Yeah, that is weird how it just comes and goes like that. Is it just like the intro? I don't know. I guess so. Don't touch the lava. That's poison, dude. Well, keeps around. Where is the other person? I don't even see that person. Oh, is it? Don't let them win. Don't let them win. Don't let win. the demons win. Oh. It's stuck there. Ah! 
At least your blood Did continued other, to move. The up. other person must have left as soon as we started and was like, "Oh boy." I like the idea that they sat through all the tutorials when they got in the game, and they're like, oh, boy. Well, the other person was a higher level, so he mm. probably saw that we were two amateurs. And I see. He doesn't want to win. That, or he saw what an intimidating demon slayer I am. I think that's right. Oh, oh my God. Got to get out of here. Yeah, none of these weapons are upgraded either, which... Uh, my dog hates me, says Jeff um, is way too passive of a dude. Unclunch that butt and go ham. Go ham. Go ham on that butt. Good. Should you be focusing on the little baby boys or the big I dog? I feel like he'll just... He'll just summon more of those guys, right? Yeah. Come on, pet. Oh. That little jerk took the shot I was trying to do with the big jerk. I mean, this should okay, be a layup. Mr. Hippo. Get that shield out of there. Demons don't have shields. Welcome to our turf. Oh, man. I almost killed him. Get him. Yeah! Gotcha! We'll see you in hell. In a bad way. I can't believe I managed to kill someone. Uh, let's see. Who pointed out? Bob Buell pointed out that it's very weird that the announcer voice goes, round one. And then when you win the round, it goes, yes. round one. <laughs> Are they being cheeky? I don't know. Oh, God. Right. Yeah, I guess that's the only time you have music, so they gotta make a count. Yeah, and do they? Oh, now he's running scared. Ouch, I'm on fire. Yep. Better Let's hide, see. buddy. Where's your spawn now? And I know you don't have a buddy to help you, but still, we're gonna go all out on you. That's right. Yeah, look at that. Ah! Oh, nice one. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Get out of there! You're right in the hell spawn. And there's a beam from heaven coming down. <laughs> <laughs> I still have plenty of health, it's fine. Oh, he blocked my loot, did oh, you? Oh, man. Get out of here. Ah! Doing your shield. A lot Can't more last staring forever. at each other than I expected. Okay, here we go. I mean, you are just... There we go. Wow. It was the extra explosion that goes off of those bolts. Nice. Nicely done, dude. Ah, uh, it's the Hammer of Dawn, people point out. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, exactly. Uh, sure, let's do this one. Let's do it again. That other guy was right to run away. Yep. He knew it. He, he could knew tell. It. Oh, what the hell? People say you should switch weapons more. Yeah. But Hippo hasn't really figured out how bad this one is for him, so... Ah. Uh. Because it sticks in him and then it explodes. Why doesn't he summon things and then just completely run away? You know, that's what I'd be doing. Like a coward. Yeah, block the loot. I don't care. I'm not going for the loot. Yeah, come back, pal. He does... That guy is a pain. Uh, kind of skull-looking guy. No. Because I have to charge this one up before I shoot it. That does sound like a pain. <laughs> oh no! Not the pit! That's fine. The pit's fine. My outline is hidden. When it's two verses, both demons have to be dead at the same time since they oh, respawn. Oh, that sounds terrible. That sounds really hard. Welcome. Sorry. Can he get health back? I don't know. Oh, man. No, He's wondering I... the same thing. No lock on for those rocks. Really? Oh, oh. No. him anyway. Locked on enough. Victory. All right, there we go.
I think that means I never have to play the multiplayer. Game. I think that's the way that works. Hey, thanks for tuning in to our Doom Eternal Great Goatee Hunt stream, everybody. We appreciate it. Uh, if you enjoyed this stream and you want to check out more of our work in the future, including plenty of exclusive stuff, check out patreon.com slash minmax 2 It's right above you, Jeff. Um, oh, right there. You got Probably. it. All right, thanks so much. Uh, we're going to be recording the Game Club for Animal Crossing New Horizons right after this. That's why we have to get ready here um, with a bunch of new guests. That's going to be a really fun time. And then we have the MinMax show recording going live tomorrow for Patreon supporters. Um, and then for everybody else on Thursday. All right, thanks so much for tuning in, everybody. We'll see ya.